Listen, God does not give money. If you like, sleep in the church and keep shouting, I receive, I receive, my dear. Nothing will happen. If you like, close your account to sow a seed of faith. If you don't understand the art of success dispensation, my dear, you will still be poor. God has made everything available for everyone, including riches. You just have to work smartly and consistently if you must ascertain a financial breakthrough. Working hard is not enough. That's why some people work hard but are still poor. If you must excel in life, you must commit yourself more on mental work. You must work smart. Wealth is not always created by strength, but by mental work and strategic diligence. If you delve more on mental work towards achieving a goal, the ability for too much struggle will reduce dramatically. Oh yes. Working smart entails the exploration of opportunities with great innovation and consistency. Trying and trying all over again in one business is not the true definition of consistency. The true definition of consistency is changing what you know if what you know cannot change you. If you have tried and tried and you are not seeing any positive impact, try different thing. Your success might lie on that different thing you tried. The problem of some people is that you only save money for consumption, you don't save money for compassion. Making money without dreams is like making nothing. When your mother gives birth to you, it is your duty to give birth to your dream. If you must achieve greatness, you must learn how to project yourself towards achieving it. Oh yes, you cannot be great if you can't create. Having money does not make you rich. If you don't have wisdom, you are still poor, no matter how much you have in your account. If you don't get committed to mental work, you will end up doing menial work. You are not working on self-development. You don't have any skill. You don't have what you are building yourself on. And you are believing God for financial breakthroughs. My dear, stop dreaming and start working. God does not answer the prayer of an empty mind and lazy hands. Praying without working is like playing without knowing. You cannot succeed if you can't sow the seed of hard work. If you are not creating positive relationship towards achieving goals, don't expect to get rewarded at the end. You cannot reap where you didn't sow. Finally, life is just like gravity. For you to move, you have to push. And if you don't push, it will pull you down. A word is enough for the wise. See you in my next video.